All right, everybody. Hello, and welcome to the Fox News Now stream. I have my co-host, Mike Page, up here with me today. We're both in blue, by hey, the way. Hey, we got the hue of blue on a Thursday. I love it. We match our logos. So I, we didn't yes. do this on purpose, I swear. We blend in a little bit. Sometimes, <laughs> you know what, what? We like it because sometimes when the bosses come by, they it, we kind of blend in. Yeah, they can't see us. Yeah, you know, so, they walk by and so we where got... Where's Mike Mary Kate? We definitely have less questions. Yeah, and I, I do want to talk about this story. You actually brought this up to me this morning. Really interesting story about a man that was stuck inside an ATM. Can you imagine this? You're taking out money at an ATM and then you hear a faint little, help me, help me. I would be like, okay, what's going on? I cannot believe this happened. And it's okay to laugh a little bit because he is okay. He's okay. But this is just a bizarre story uh, in Texas. It was out of Corpus Christi and he was just a repairman who was inside the building that was connected to the ATM. Right. So it was the small, like, little storage area, if you, if you could imagine it. That you go where, through it to get in the back of yeah, the Yeah, so he was trying to work on the ATM in the back end of it, and, well, he got stuck in that room. He couldn't get out. He didn't even have a cell phone. Or the device to unlock himself. No, no. He was definitely stuck. So he's, like, pretty much in a panic mode, as you can imagine. Oh, I mean, like, absolutely. And then, this is the best part. So people are getting their receipt. They're not getting their bank receipt. They're getting, he's feeding a little uh, piece of paper that says, please help me, I'm stuck in here. I need help. This is, you know, something like a, this, this yeah. isn't a joke here. Please call for help. Let me or no, up. please call my boss is, is what he said here. Yeah, pull it up, Mary Kate. Give him a great look here. Yeah, take a look at the picture. I mean, this is obviously a picture of the ATM, but these are the little notes that he was sticking <laughs> through, you know, as people were expecting a receipt, they would see notes like this. Please help. I'm stuck in here. I don't have a, a phone. Please call my boss. And then, you know, leave the boss's number. So what do you think about this? I would just, I would be, I think if, if it happened... If I was getting the money out, right. I would think I was being punk somehow. And I thought this may be some kind of hidden prank, you know, kind of uh, show. Yeah, it would be hard to, to imagine that that would be real. Although, how couldn't you hear him? I mean, if he's yelling, <sighs> was he yelling? He was trying to yell, but he, they, they said it was a faint. The, what they heard from the other side was it was faint. It's, they called it a little voice they heard. <laughs> so, I mean, and, and again, you guys, he's okay. And this yeah, was not he made a, it. a robber. This was a guy trying to fix this ATM. The issue was the lock door yeah, that he came that, to work it just, on. It got stuck. In. Poor guy. I want to pull up some video, too, for you guys just to show you uh, the scene yeah. here in Texas. This just happened yesterday. Poor guy. I can believe it. I, I mean, mean this, is, this is the epitome of having bad luck. Oh, when you yeah. think, okay, so that was the door. Okay, now this is the ATM. It's a Bank of America ATM. And he's, he's stuck the behind there. It. Yeah. He's trying to fix the lock door. It closes <laughs> on him. It locks him in. So, so that's where they needed to enter to get this guy out. Oh, look at that. And, you know, obviously, yeah, you receive these notes. You might assume it's a joke if you don't hear someone yelling. I mean, what do you do? But um, one person, thankfully, did call his yes, boss. Yes, good thing. So thank you, finally. Look at, there it is. He wrote dozens of these notes until someone finally took it seriously. Mm. So we want to hear from you guys. Let us know in the live chat section of our YouTube stream. Would you call if you received a note like this, or would you assume it's a joke? And and shout out to him for, for not even taking any money, right? Yeah, I, he, this guy deserves a raise, seriously. Props to you, man, for, for dealing with that. I mean, I'm claustrophobic. I don't think I could handle being stuck in there for almost two hours. Two hours being stuck in there, and it doesn't seem like anybody's coming to your avail, right? No one is, is trying to help you. Yeah, I mean, this would be seriously scary. And again, Again, no money missing. Yeah. What a good guy. You know, usually when we go to the ATM, you, know, you stick your card in, you put your pin. This guy needed more than a pin, right? <laughs> this guy needed <laughs> he someone needed call. Help. He, you know what the pin he needed was nine one one. He needed help, and yet he wrote dozens of these little letters, and people would just think, "Oh, funny," yeah. and leave. <laughs> I mean, come on. I, I think I would look at it for a while and kind of think about it. I'd probably call. I wouldn't assume. Yeah. But here's the thing. Now he's always going to have that phone on him now, right? 
He might have two on him. Yeah, there's, there's no way this is going to happen again. But I think the only part that really makes me laugh a little is imagining him trying to stick the little note <laughs> <laughs> just in time for them to grab it, yeah. you know? And they don't hear him, but he's trying to... <laughs> please please him. take this along with your receipt. <laughs> you know? Oh. So poor guy, and we're so glad he's okay, and, and I really hope he gets a raise or some sort of award or something at his company for yeah. doing this. Here's a reward for not dying in that room. Yeah, so uh, again... We <laughs> <laughs> we want to hear from you guys. Tweet me at Mary Kate TV or uh, Mike Page Fox 10 and let us know your thoughts. There we go, guys.